This is an urgent message. Update your Brave and Chrome browsers, especially if you use crypto, because we have crypto wallets in our browsers, MetaMask, Coinbase Wallet, Phantom Wallet, Euroi Wallet, and so on. And Google issued a warning to billions of users telling them to update their browsers. And this just came out yesterday. And at the time of publication, all the company had revealed is the threat level is Hi, so do this right now. There is no excuse. It takes one minute. If you're in Chrome, head over to Chrome, about Google Chrome, and then update your browser. As you can see, mine is now up to date. And then for Brave, same thing. Head over to Brave, about Brave, and update your browser. Really, this takes one minute, and everyone should really be doing this, but especially if you're in the crypto space. And a reminder, stop clicking random links. The founder of a DeFi venture capital fund had $1.7 million worth of NFTs stolen because he clicked a link in an email. And this person is not new to crypto. This person is well-versed in crypto and security. So Arthur Chung, founder of DeFi and Capital, had his NFT stolen because he downloaded a malicious file. He received a phishing email with content that seemed like general industry relevant content. So he downloaded the file. It was a docx file. It ended up being a malicious file. He had his NFTs stolen. So two things that we learn. Number one, when you receive an email, let's say, for example, from an exchange such as Coinbase or Gemini telling you that you are locked out of your account or your account is frozen, do not click on any links in that email. Instead, go to the website the normal way or to the app the normal way and see if it's actually true. Don't click anything through the emails. And number two, if you need to download files in emails, if possible, try doing it on a device that is not connected to your wallets. For example, let's say you have a MetaMask wallet on your desktop and you receive an email, try opening up that email and that file attachment on your phone where your wallet is not connected or maybe on a tablet where your wallet is not connected. Stay safe out there. Thank you for listening and I'll see you next time.